Hello. It has been a little while since I have gone live. Hopefully everyone can hear me. I have set this up behind me a couple of times and then my cats have destroyed it a couple of times already. One is currently sitting right beside me. Um, but yeah, it's been a little while since I have gone live. Um, so hello. Uh, we just moved out of our apartment and um, in my grandma's basement currently just it's just a midway point so that way we can um, be here for a little bit and then kind of see what's going on whenever it comes down to our other apartment situation so this isn't our final destination um, we are going to be moving again it's just depending on when um, but yeah, that's why I have not really been live. I haven't shown up, um, much because we have been crazy moving. So yeah, we need it out of, when you need out of somewhere by a certain time, it's like, it's a lot and it's stressful. So yeah, that's what happened. But I got a couple things, um, during that time frame that I wanted to show you guys. So there are a couple items that I can't show you currently because, and I probably posted pictures of them already anyway, but that's because I don't have them on hand right now because I took some stuff to the office and I took things to, um, and I have something somewhere else and I just don't have it with me currently right now. But the stuff that I took to the office, because this is why we recommend opening your own shopping link that you can share with friends and family and also like shop yourself for and with because it can be open for 90 days but because you can build up rewards um and that's something lord there's something like tickling my nose that's something that is super super important to me where it's saving you money and that's basically why I do this because it saves money. Um, so there were a couple things that I wanted to just talk about today was first of all, go ahead. Why not get a shopping link open that you could share with friends and family? Because then you can build those rewards up, get the half off items, get the, um, free Sensi and stuff like that as well, because that's what I, I ended up doing. That's how I get, most of my own stuff is not just, oh, hey, I'm putting a purchase in. No, I'm actually personally having a shopping link open to share for myself to shop on, for other people to shop on, um, that I'm building up those rewards so that way I can get the free and the half off. But my main goal is to get you and your friends and your family a free and half off. Um, so I really, I really want to build that up for you to get those rewards for you. There are a bunch of different ways to save, however. Um, so that is something to kind of look into, especially whenever it comes to getting your consumable items. If you don't even want a shopping link, okay, cool, that's fine. But... Let's talk about getting you the other way of earning some, like, savings. Because there is what we call club. Stay with me. Club is free. It's free. That's where you're getting your consumables. That's how you're saving money without having a shopping link to share. That's something where I'm going to recommend that to anybody and especially you because why not? Why wouldn't you want to save money? So if you want your consumable goods, let's chat. Let's look into it because... Why is club important? Why is it amazing? Why do we talk about it? Because it's free, for one thing. You're not ever paying any monthly fee to be part of it, ever. It's not a subscription that you pay this many bucks. It's not Okay, so it's not like Amazon Prime. 
It's not like Audible. It's not like, um, what's another one? I'm trying to think. But it's not a subscription where you pay per month whether you get something through it or not. It's something where you put your consumable goods in a cart. And I'm going to smell these with you in a couple seconds. But say that you have Scentsy Pods that you really love. You'll love these. These guys can last depending. It depends. Um, we go nose blind. So what I do is I actually take these. I'll use one or two. And then when I go nose blind, I take this pack and I put them right back in that pack. And then whenever I put them back in that pack, it can replenish, and then I just swap it like I, like I kind of do my wax. But these guys you can use a couple of times, which is nice. So that's what I do. But say that you got pods, okay? You have a fan diffuser. You have pods that you're using. You put these pods, for example, in your club order. Okay, so uh, let's say, all right, I go through my club. Like, I go through my pods every two months say that I got like a couple pods in there that are my favorites and then I have these two let's just say I have these two I went through these two already I can't smell them anymore they're done it's over it's been two months now I need new ones well guess what I could take these have them in my club and I can have them shipped to me every two months that way I'm not sitting there like, oh, I need to reorder these. No, it's there for that month. Every two months, I'm going to constantly, I'm going to get these guys. These guys are going to send to me. Now, that is as long as the scents are available. Um, the only thing that you can get for good, and that club will get you for life, as long as it is in your club before it discontinues, is wax. Club has that wax. Always get my bar program. That is mainly what I use it for. Because when I have my favorite wax, I want it in the club. Because if that wax goes away and I end up in tears, that's the thing. That's what I want. That's what I want to focus on with my club a lot of the time currently has just been kind of wax because I'm like, okay, I need to put my wax on there. And because these waxes are discontinued, they, I put them in there cause I knew they were discontinuing and now they're discontinued. And now the only way that I can continue getting them is because Sensi keeps making them for me because they're in my club. Make sense? So yeah, drop questions in the comments, please. I will 100% answer, um, at any point in time, but that's the thing about club is you really want to look into it and do it. If you're making a big order of consumable goods that you use, you like, you use, or you don't, you're not sure you like, okay? If you don't even know if you like it, just drop them in the club because that way you're paying for your goods, but you're also going to be saving money. And that's what I want to talk about, too, about that is, okay, so we already talked about how club is free. There are no fees. So even if you sign up for club and you don't even add anything in, you don't add anything to your card. It's empty. Your monthly is empty. Your bi-monthly is empty. Your quarterly is empty. That's okay. Because you're not getting charged for anything. Delete, add, edit, whatever. Skip, whatever with your club. You're not going to be charged unless you have something in your club, which means if I have these two pods in my bi-monthly club, these two pods are all I'm paying for. That's it. I'm paying for it every bi-month and that's it. Plus shipping and tax. But if I take these out and I don't have anything in my club, I'm not paying anything. I'm not being charged anything because I don't have anything in my club. Why, why are you going to be charged for not having something in your club cart? It just doesn't make any sense to me to pay a fee 
per month for something that you're not quite utilizing right now. We don't do that here. We don't do that here at all. So my suggestion is if you have any consumable goods, anything that you use up, so like laundry, cleaning, body, um, fragrance, anything that's usable, that's used up over time, add that to a club. Because when you add that to a club, you're going to continue to kind of get that. However often you want to, you can pick between monthly, bi-monthly, or quarterly, or all three. You can add that to that. If you don't want it that month, you could say, okay, skip. I'm skipping this month. And you can do that. If you are... Um, Say that you, okay, I'm fed up with this. Like, okay, I'm bored. Coastal sunsets, boring now. I've gotten it so many times. I'm so used to it. Or I have so many of it that I just don't need it on my club anymore. Go into your club and delete it off. Delete it off. Delete it off. And then that item's off. And now you can add another scent. You can add another item. You could do whatever you want. Edit, delete, skip, add, whatever. But you're not getting charged for anything but what's in that club cart already. I'm moving on from that. If anybody has any questions regarding that, let me know in the comments. But I'm moving on from that because um, I know it can get wordy. But here's the thing about club that I love the most you save money. You don't even have to have a shopping link that you share or anything like that. You save money. You literally save money to where it's, okay, if you have $30 worth of items in that club order that you put, you set up, you got it. Doesn't matter if it's monthly, bi-monthly, quarterly, all three, it doesn't matter. If there is one, so say since we were on the bi-month chat, Say that I had $30 worth of consumable items in that bi-month chat. Uh, whoa. In that bi-month cart. I'm saving 10% on that $30. Because as soon as I hit that $30 mark, the 10% is tacked on there. You don't get that if you make a $30 purchase on my regular website. You only get that if you make the $30 purchase in consumable items on club. Another thing about Club that I love, and this is something consultants don't get, which makes me love it even more. Because consultants get paid on their orders. It doesn't matter what their orders are, they get paid on their orders. Insert <laughs> um, income disclosure here, because I have to do that, and I'm going to have to do that in the comments later. Um, but... When it comes down to being a consultant, you get paid off of your own items. So you make a 20% back on your own items. I like to call it a rebate. So you're getting rebated on every single purchase that you get, plus saving money in the ways that you can save money by having your open shopping link to use and build up those rewards to get the half off and free, or even, um, do the club where it's like, okay, you spend $30 and you get an automatic 10% off. And then also I forgot to mention before I mention this next thing that consultants don't get is when you spend 60 in the club, you actually get 10% off plus a half off item. That's amazing. Okay. I love that. All right. I love that. But the thing consultants do not get that I love the most about club is You earn points. So, for every dollar you spend in club, again, club is free, and if you have something, I picked up two different cents. If you have something in the club, say that you just have these two pods, okay, you are getting charged for the two pods, tax, and shipping. All right, cool, that's it. Take these out, you ain't getting charged anything. But add these in, you have up to $30, you have up to 60, whatever. 
you're getting points on every dollar you are spending. So even if you put these two in, um, these are 10 each. So even if you put $20 worth in, guess what? You're getting 20 points because you get a point per dollar. So you're getting 20 points. This is 10 points. This is 10 points. You're getting 20 points because you just spent 20. So that's amazing because now you've got 20 points in there that if you're keeping an eye on that, you can actually go and build those up. And once you build them up to a certain point, guess what? That saves you more money because now you can use your points on your club orders or on orders in my website to save even more money. That's freaking amazing. But it doesn't stop there. And I know I sound like an infomercial, um, but it doesn't stop there because you have a referral link. Anybody that is part of club has a referral link to be able to use and send to friends and family and say, dude, I know you love fragrance. You love things that smell amazing. What about taking part in this and going and adding everything you love to this and now you don't even have to worry about running out or forgetting again because we have all been to where it's it's been stressful to where it's like oh my gosh we just used and I just did this the other day um, we just used the last of insert the blank just insert whatever for me it was my bathroom cleaner the other day I ran out of my favorite bathroom cleaner and I was so upset because I was like I didn't finish my bathroom I had to go and find everything else I had on hand to utilize because I didn't have enough to finish my bathroom and what's crazy and I'm crazy is I could have put that on my club that could have been on my club, but I wasn't thinking. So I didn't have it on my club. So if I had that on my club for every like month, by month or quarter, then I would be getting that and I wouldn't have had to worry about the fact of running out and be like, dang it, I forgot to order more. So that is where that saves you out also. But referral link. If you use that referral link and you refer a friend and that friend joins club and adds their stuff to club, now they added, say they added two pod packs in there. Now they have 20 points and you now have 40? Because <laughs> you get two points. I'm not the best at math, y'all. I'm just not. Um, because you have two points sure. per every dollar. Your friend that you referred that joins club through your referral link spends even more money saved because you're building those points and you are using those points for future club orders or for future um, orders in general. Okay? So yeah, think about the club. Go ahead and do it. If that is, if partying, if I hate that word, but if getting your own shopping link to share, having an event, anything like that is not in the cards for you, is not something that you want to do, you just, you're like, nope, no thanks, then do that. Still get your goods. Still save the money. Earn the points. Share with friends who also love fragrance. Be like, here's my referral link, guys. Everywhere does that now. You do it already with everything else. Here's my referral link. Go ahead and grab this. And every time that they do, guess what? You get something from it. Because you're helping that business out too, which is amazing. Helping yourself and you're helping your business. So there you go. But either way, that's a great way to do it because you can skip, you can edit, you can add, you can do whatever, but you're still saving money. And right now, saving money is a huge thing. But that being said, and I'm not going to really talk too, too much on this part of it, but that being said, if fragrance is what you love, 
and you love smell goods and you want something that's way better for your family and you want to save even more money, set up, let's talk about actually getting that 20% rebate. Why not? Because that 20% rebate is why I started with this business. Because I was like, uh, I'm working. I'm already doing something else that I liked. I was like, I really love all this stuff. I really, I can't use candles because it just doesn't work out. It gives me headaches. My cats like to climb things. Like, it was just, it was a certain, there was so many things adding up that I was just like, ugh. And my apartment smelled like cat litter for a little while. And I was doing everything I could, but everything I used gave me migraines. And it sucked. So I found out about this. Found out about Sensi. And I was like, you know what? I want to see what that's all about. I want to see if that causes problems or headaches. And to be honest with you, I fell in love with everything. To the point where my list was like... It could go a mile long as to what I wanted. So, I decided, you know what, I'm diving in. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm getting that rebate. I'm getting all this. I'm getting that rebate. My intention was not to do this. But I did. I started doing this. Because as soon as I got my stuff, I found no headaches. Oh my gosh, my cats can hang around it. It's, it's amazing. So, I... I decided I'm going to share this with people, but the reality is, is I started this because of the 20% rebate because I was like, I don't necessarily have this money to spend, but that would be very nice to get this money back to basically sit and be like, okay, here's everything that I want. I just paid for that. And now the next month I'm getting my rebate. I'm getting my 20% rebate. So whatever I spent, I got my 20% rebate. And you know, that was nice. That was nice, okay? But anyway, so just think about it like that. Who wants that rebate? Seriously, who wants that rebate? But anyway, so moving on because I have things to show you. I snagged quite a few things. And like I said, I don't have some of it. So what I don't have is I don't have Dobby. So I don't have Dobby. Um, I took him to work. Uh, he's adorable. He's amazing. He looks even better in person. But I don't have Dobby with me right now. He's at work. Um, I also got our golden snitch. Um, I got our golden snitch. Who is a little buddy clip. Smells so good. I have it on my backpack. Um, I will share a picture of that later because it's cute. And to be honest with you, it's probably the only time that I've ever seen a Slytherin catch the golden snitch. Just being honest. So it's on my book bag. Um, but I got another couple of things that I don't have because I did take them to the office to utilize around the office. Um, the new black, um, all black wall fan diffuser fits the two pods so fits two of these in there um you just take it off put it on clip it in like plug it in hit the button and it has a light i need to get another one for here um but that one i took to work because i was like you know what whatever the guys needs a little something so i gave it to my boss and told him to use it for whatever i got them the sandalwood and tangerine pods to go with it because it's kind of manly and then I got the mountain sunset um spray so I got that like the room spray for them but the things I'm gonna go over now are definitely on hand and these are the things the other things that I got um oh and I also got kukui and coconut in the pods as well for my air diffuser um air purifier sorry which I took to work. Um, I have to get a new filter with that. So I got the filter and I'm waiting for it to show up. Um, but 
that's at work too. So I put one of those there so that way it's sitting in the office and smelling all good. But anywho, so this is, these are the things that I got um, for actually having that open shopping link, putting my own orders on it, putting friends' orders on it, and everything else and sharing that. This is what I got for free and half off. So Dobby and the Snitch, I did not get free and half off because are licensed products. So anything that's like Warner Brothers, um, Universal related, Disney, DC, uh, Marvel, things like that are an NHL and NFL and stuff like that. Those are licensed products. So those are something that you don't get for free and half off, but they do go and add like bump your rewards up, which is amazing. So that's what I did. Um, but this little dude right here, so this gorgeous thing is a fragrance flower. I'm going to open that up because I need a new one. And I'm debating on whether I should set this up, to be honest. I might. Um, it's in Pink Sunshine. This is the one that was for the Valentine's Day collection. Um, they had that available until it was sold out. I have not been able to really check to see if it was officially sold out but the thing is about this one is it's colored this is our first ever flower that has been colored okay it's red all right so I snagged it last second I know last second probably not always the best idea oh I can already smell it oh but anyway so these are what our fragrance flowers look like. I'm debating on setting it up. I might not set it up right now because I'm sad, guys. Because the one that I had set up at the apartment, I didn't know how to move it properly without it, it spilling and causing a problem. So we had to throw it away. It was already kind of down to here, though, so it was getting close to that. But... Um, these guys can last for up to 60 days, so I might save this for whenever we're at our new apartment or wherever we're going to be. Because again, we don't know how long we're going to be here, and I don't want to set this up and then have to throw it away. Because the oil in these guys, it's super strong, okay? It is fragrant, it's amazing, it's the best thing. Um, these guys are gorgeous, these are handmade handmade oh my gosh can you even believe that like I couldn't even do that but anyway so when you open this you got to be very careful very careful and you want to open it over a surface that's non-porous that's not painted that's not nice wood just saying I open them usually in my kitchen or my bathroom um because this is so concentrated that it can eat through paint and stuff like that. So like, I would not use it as a nail polish remover, but I'm just saying, it did take some of my nail polish off because I accidentally <laughs> spilled some on my other one. <laughs> but anyway, so these guys are amazing. These guys are great for small spaces. They're awesome. They work super duper well. Um, we had ours in our bathroom for going on two months before we moved out and it still smelled good in there and it was a tiny bathroom but it still smelled good in there so you can use it in a small space you can use it as just decoration and then every time you walk past it you smell it stuff like that but it these are these are awesome and these are great gifts too really great gifts now I'm not gonna do it with this one but because it, it's going to color itself I'm hoping Sensi does more of these because this was really cool but, um, the tips of these, so like if you would take a Sharpie and color the tips of the flowers, sometimes I'll just go and like color the edge, um, or one of ours, this one is a Dahlia. I'm pretty sure this is a Dahlia. Give me a second. Yeah, Dahlia. This one is a Dahlia. So... These ones are a little harder to do what I'm about to say, but are buttercup bells. You can go in and actually color the inside a little bit and then put this in the oil. And I'm going to be honest with you, it gets pretty. 
So it might look a little choppy at first, but after you color a little bit on there and you put it in the oil and you let that oil soak up in these guys, it starts to disperse and look amazing. Trust me, grab one of these with the clear liquid and do it. I promise you, you'll love it. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. So, next up, we got new body products. So, first of all, this isn't really new. This, I just needed some. And this is something that I really should put on Club. Because y'all go, y'all know that you go out of, you get, oh my gosh, you run out of hand soap so fast. So vanilla waves, I love vanilla and vanilla waves reminds me a little bit about like a vanilla lemon, like cupcake. I don't know. I love it. It's amazing, but I snagged it. So this is actually what our new hand soaps look like. They're larger. They're larger. So this is a 11 fluid ounce. Whenever we had about a seven, Point five or something like that before ours before was smaller it was probably like half this but it was like really cute and chubby but this guy right here is enough and it's a lot it's a pretty bottle you can take it put it in another bottle it's up to you I have to get my Jack and Jim bottles um, figured out for that because my Jack bottle screwed up before, but I am definitely going to utilize, I'm a whiskey girl, all right, I'm a whiskey girl, I'm just going to be honest, I'm a whiskey girl, I don't drink it like crazy, but if that's my go-to, if I'm somewhere, I'm like, dude, I need, like, I'm going to get a drink, it's usually a Jack and Coke, or a Jim and Coke, or red stag, whatever, but I have bottles. All right. And I loved the idea of doing the bottles where it's, you make them into soap dispensers. So I need to mod podge them and make them into soap dispensers. I had one before, but I didn't mod podge it in time. So it's a little bit of a mess, but I have another one. So we're good, but I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. Okay. Cause country vibes here, farmhouse country vibes and it's going to happen. But anywho, so the next body product that I'm actually excited about, I thought it was very smart that they did this. Very smart. So Just Breathe, okay? Just Breathe has been a popular scent for a long time. So that is a popular scent that people get every single allergy season um, through the spring. People stock up on this scent. Like I am telling you right now, it's amazing. It actually works really well, but I'm so happy that they actually brought it in the, sorry, this plastic might get a little loud, that they actually put it in the body line. I almost dropped it. Don't mind me. On the struggle bus. Okay, so they actually put it in the body line, and I decided, you know what? Allergy season's coming up. Allergy season. I get hit hard with those things, okay? And then it causes seasonal colds or sinus weirdness. It's just, you know. But just breathe. They just put this in our body line. So now we have just breathe in this, in um, hand soap, in body cream and hand cream. Um, so yeah, definitely. So I'm actually gonna, yep. This will clear the sinuses. I love it. Okay. But I figured, I was like, you know what? Allergy season's coming. Where's one of the best places to release all this? When you're congested, the shower. The shower. So what am I going to do? I'm going to use this in the shower. Get your mind out of the gutter for one. But in the shower, to help with all this when it's all dumped up. You know? So anyway, that's what I'm going to do. That's what I'm going to do. 
I recommend doing the same dang thing, okay? So, yeah, but we have it in our fragrances as well. We have it in pods and stuff like that, too. So those are the only two body things that I have right now. <laughs> I'll test it out and let you all know. But, anywho, so, the pods that I got, again, I took, first of all, I'm going to let you know, I got six pods, six pods, for free. For free. Why'd I get them for free? Because I had an open party link. I had a link open to shop and share and got all the goods, okay? I got all the goodies, all right? Y'all need to do the same. But what if I didn't do that? What if I put, so you can bundle and save on my website, which by the way, you can bundle and save and get that bundle for free or half off when you have that shareable link for you to shop and your friends and family to shop. <laughs> Hello? But anyway, so there's that. There's that going on. There's that going on. But I got six of these for free. Two are at work. Like I said, the sandalwood and tangerine is at work for the men. And the kukui, I don't know how to say that. Um, and coconut is over there by my desk being used up. To smell amazing, you know, while also cleaning the air. But anywho, these are the remaining four that I got, okay? The remaining four. So, pink rhubarb sugar, I fell in love with a while ago, whenever it came out last year. It's sweet, it's sugary, it smells like candy, it smells amazing. I needed it again. I was like, you know what, why the heck not? in a pod. Why the heck not? So pods. Our pods are amazing. Our pods have these little non-toxic beads in them that are all scented. You know what these beads are also used for? Our scent packs. Yeah. That's what they're used for. Our scent packs too. So they're in here. They're amazing. You stick this in a fan and it'll blow right through and just disperse it everywhere. It's heatless, it's waxless, it's mess free, it's perfect for the fans where you put them, whether it's the little mini fans that you put by your like on your desk, whether it's the wall fans that you put in like the walkways where you can't put a warmer or the fan diffuser, I mean the air purifier or the Sensi Go, okay? The Sensi Go, you can put these in there. It's battery operated to where it's rechargeable and then you just take it everywhere and you carry it everywhere. I sometimes like to put it in my purse. It just depends, but fits two of these, yada, yada. Now that is what these are for, but make sure if you put them in the car with you that you take them out because summer is coming and that's just going to be not good for these guys. So make sure you're doing that. But this smells amazing. Okay. That is pink rhubarb sugar, okay? If you love sugary, fruity, uh, tart kind of smelling things, kind of sweet, but not at the same time, oh, this is this, go for it. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, so Coastal Sunset was my favorite also when it came out two years ago. I think, yeah, two years ago. <laughs> Something like that. Whatever. But anyway, it came out a while ago and has been my favorite ever since. Okay, this is tropical. This is very, if you are sitting there and you're just like, man, I wish I was at the beach, whatever. You know what? You don't even have to go to the beach. Okay? Just pop some of these in. Get your favorite drink, like a pina colada or margarita, whatever you want to do. Go sit out. And just hang out. Trust me. And maybe put some bird noises on. I don't know, but in ocean waves. But trust me, this is going to transport you. Because it smells amazing. Very tropical and coconutty. Definitely worth it. One of you is trying to pop out there. Yeah. It's a little lighter than 
this dude the pink rhubarb sugar but it's worth it it's worth it it's worth it one of my favorites is the waxes but one of my favorites that was when we came out with it was the cleaning products the cleaning line in this is to die for to die for okay literally you want to snag this in any way that you can with if excuse me if you like tropical um kind of coconutty kind of like fruity like a little it reminds me so we have pina colada cha-cha but it this reminds me of a pina colada in a way i don't know it just smells really fresh and kind of clean and it's it's amazing. I love it. It's to die for. Okay, whipped vanilla lavender. This is one that came out for Mother's Day last year. Okay, this came out for Mother's Day last year. It sold out pretty fast. Okay, so it sold out pretty fast. And yeah, so I had gotten it for the mothers in my life. Um, I would gotten a few things to give to them. And then I kind of kept the shave cream and the hand cream because I need to use hand cream. My hands dry out very easily. Um, but I got that for my, and kept it for myself. But whipped vanilla lavender is back. It's back in our fragrance department. So if you loved it then, you can get it again now. So whipped lavender vanilla. That's more floral. For sure. The lavender's there. The vanilla's a hint. Like the vanilla is just a little bit of a hint. The lavender really hits you, but it's not super duper strong. Um, keep in mind our pods can smell different than our waxes because of how they're made. Um, same with the scent packs and stuff like that because they're made with the same beads. But these are made a little bit different. These might come off a little bit stronger because of how they work and because you're doing a fan instead of warming. Um, so keep that in mind. They might smell a little bit different, but trust me, put them in wherever you're putting them in with the fan, diffusers, air purifier, whatever, and you'll you'll still love it, I promise. But... But try it, because our noses are different, our noses are weird, and sometimes things are a little different, and you might like something better in the pods than you do the wax, or you might like something better in the wax than you do the pods, and vice versa, all that stuff. Okay, this is my husband's favorite. White, amber, and teak. He loves it. So, this one in particular, because I've actually smelled it... <laughs> in the wax and the room spray so we have the room spray we got that and it smells kind of similar but I kind of like it in the wax form a bit more than the room spray form so I haven't smelled it in this form yet so I don't 100% know about this one yet but I'm gonna tell you right now Okay, this smells actually more like the room spray, and which is fine. The room spray, I might give this to him for his car. The room spray is a bit stronger. The pod's a bit stronger. The wax, to me, is, is just right. Like, it's just right. It's just enough. It works fine. It works well. It's just enough. It's fine. It's amazing. Not too big of a fan when it comes to the room spray. He likes it, so that's why I keep it. Um, I don't think I'm a big fan of it as a pods, to be fair and to be honest with you. Um, but that's something that he likes, so I'm like, okay, I'll, he can use it in his car with his little um, mini fan diffuser. Mini fan diffusers are USB operated. And they can go into small places that have a USB port. Um, they're great for small desks. They're great for cars. Um, but they use one pod. So that's something that he could probably use in his car. Um, one more thing. Because I actually need to put this in my car. Because I don't have my car bars yet. 
So I'm going to actually open this because I need to put this in my car eventually anyway. I'm going to open this. This is what a scent circle is. This is one of the things that I'm going to show you right now is how to really utilize a scent circle to the fullest. What you want to do is you do not want to open this up completely. You want to leave this in there as long and as best and you can, okay? This is going to help you keep the fragrance a lot longer. So. <gasps> no, it opened! Okay, so here's what I'm going to try to do. Ah. Uh, sorry, hubby was calling just a second ago. Uh, we'll call him back. Okay, anyway, it opened on the side whenever I did that for some reason. So give me just a second. I'm going to show you what I would do. What I would do if it didn't all the way kind of open like that. I might still do it. It might still work. Okay, so all I have is a knife. Bear with me. Use scissors. Use scissors for this. Um, but in order to make this last longer, okay, what you want to do is you want to make a slot with scissors up at the top. Make sure that doesn't fall. Take that down to the bottom. I could cheat a little bit because it's open on the side and I didn't want it to do that, but it's okay. And then pull the string through that hole that you made. If it'll let me. I'm trying to get to it. Lord have mercy. We are almost there. But you want to pull the string through that hole. We are going to get there. I promise we are going to get there. This is just being a pain in the butt. Okay. This might help a little bit more. Okay. So, I got it. Woohoo! It worked! So, clearly it might take a little bit. But what you'll want to do is you'll want to pull this through the plastic and then cut the plastic down here and do it that way. So that way whenever you cut the plastic down here, it's still hanging through here. Let me fold that. Let me do that. It's still hanging through here and the fragrance will release here. Then as like, okay, you get into your car and you're like, I don't really smell it anymore. Cut a little bit more off. Wait until you don't smell it anymore. Cut a little bit more off. Keep going until it's completely gone. Until the plastic is completely gone. And then when you don't smell it again, after the plastic is completely gone, time to get rid of it. Time to get a new one. So easy peasy lemon squeezy. This one's going to go in my cur. So I will actually... I'll just utilize it the same way, you know? I'll just cut this bottom off. I'll do that. I'll put it in my car. Um, and then when I don't smell it anymore, cut a little bit. When I don't smell it again, cut it a little bit. Whenever I don't smell it again, take the plastic off. And then when I don't smell it again, what am I going to do? Get new ones. Okay? So that's what I will do. So there's that for that part. The last thing that I'm going to go over is actually the scent of the month. Um, the scent of the month is in the... Um, this is our monthly special guys. So this is what we do monthly. It's our monthly special and this one's actually pretty cool. Um, my grandma has this upstairs now, um, but the warmer is awesome. So if you love lighthouses, you want to snag the warmer, but here is what we have going on this month. The warmer is called light your way. It's 11 inches tall. It's got a 20 watt bulb. It is whitewashed metal, um, and it's a, one of our glow warmers because it glows through the little windows and pieces and up the top and everything like that, almost like a lighthouse would. So it's a classic coastal landmark. The metal lighthouse has a hopeful glow shining the way to your fragrance destination. So here is, it. it's normally $65, but it's actually $58.50 this month, so it's 10% off. But here's what that looks like there. 
So that's pretty pretty. Did not mean to do that. Um, now the actual scent itself. Whoa. Don't know what that was. The actual scent itself is called chamomile petals. Is it chamomile or chamomile? Um, petals. And it's let a melody, a medley, can't read, of cam. Oh, it was a gnat. Jeez Louise. They're here already? Anyway, so, anyway. Uh, let a medley of chamomile petals, jasmine, and apple transport you to a refreshing sunny afternoon. This is part of our floral category. The top notes, which are the first... Sorry, I'm like trying not to sneeze. Um, top notes, which are the first thing that typically hits your nose whenever you pick up the bar and you smell it. The first thing that hit your nose is the top note. That's the chamomile petals. The mid note, the thing that you're going to smell whenever it starts to warm, when it starts to get warmed in that warmer you have, your favorite warmer, you're going to smell the jasmine. The bass note, which will start to really meld in to whenever it's warming and possibly even towards the end, is going to be apple. Top note is typically what makes you want to try it. Mid note is typically where it's like, ooh, do I like this, don't like this, whatever. The bass note is going to be what basically tells you, do I want to get this again? So those are ways to kind of think about that. Um, it comes in a Scentsy bar, and those are also 10% off at 540. Room spray, 10% off at 720. Scent circle, 10% off at 270, okay? Available all month, 10% off. This is the bar. This is what our bars look like. Six instead, I mean, eight. Eight instead of six. If you go anywhere else, you normally get six. If you go here, you typically, you're going to get the eight, okay? If you get a brick, which is on club, there's specific scents for bricks on club, you're going to get way more than that. Um, you're going to get actually five and a half worth of bars. So if you have a favorite scent, go look on club, see if it's there, and get a brick. Promise you will not regret that. Okay, chamomile petals. I'm going to smell it. Yeah, so definitely first thing that hit my nose was the florals. That was the chamomile petals, okay? That is the first thing. Here's the best way to actually smell a bar because everything kind of goes, sinks to the bottom. So the best way to smell a bar is not like this, but popping it out. So you want your finger on this middle one, okay? On this middle one, you want to push gently on the middle one, pops out into your hand. Ta-da! This is where you want to smell it. So, because I'm smelling it from the bottom, I'm actually getting the chamomile petals and the jasmine. There's a little hint of apple, so I don't 100% know what this is going to smell like yet. Warmed. And that's where it's going to make me really decide. Because as a bar form, it's not, it's not my go-to type of fragrance. Not something that I would personally buy again. Not something that I would personally put in club. Um, it's too florally for me. It's not something that I really enjoy much. It's not a bad scent, but it's just, it's way, it's way too florally for me. I'm just, I'm not really a floral person, but if you are a floral person, you're going to want to try this. Um, but anywho, so you're going to want to try it. You're going to want to get it and I will warm it, um, and kind of see what it's like warmed because here's the deal. Here's a little tip. Just because you don't like it in the bar format does not necessarily mean that you're going to hate it when you warm it. I never recommend just smelling the bar format and then deciding, Meh. give it a shot, give it a try. Mm -hmm. If you like it, you'll know after warming. So warm it first before you make your true decision. Warm it. 
if you already have it already. Um, if it's not something that you really, really kind of, you're like, okay, I really don't like it. It's okay. I'm not somebody who really always likes to buy something that I don't think I'm really going to like. Um, so I'm not going to push that on anybody. But if this is something where it's like you have it and you smell it and you're like, oh, I don't really know about it, warm it first. Warm one to two blocks in a warmer, warm it, and see how it goes. But that is where I leave you guys. I know this was a long video. I'm sorry. This has been a very long month. Um, March was. And yeah, so I'm ready to be back and going and up and running. And I'm so excited um, to start really giving my all and my best to you guys again. Um, so yeah, uh, if you were just catching the end, go ahead and rewatch this. I'm actually going to post this on YouTube. So you'll be able to see it there too. Um, but yeah, so thanks guys for watching and hanging out. And I really hope that you have a really great Sunday. Um, Easter's coming up. So Easter plans, man. Easter's coming up fast. Huh. But anyway, have fun. And if you need anything for Easter gift wise, talk to me. We'll figure something out. But I hope you guys have a great Sunday and I will chat with y'all soon. Bye.